Coach, I tell you what, uh, it never seems like you get a whole lot of time off, and then you add the athletic director duties to your uh, table there. Well, how do you balance all that? Well, I, you know, I'm fortunate I've got a really good coaching staff that kind of steps in and helps out whenever I need help, and, and uh, those guys are, have been there for me for quite some time, and uh, they always seem to find a way to get the little things done that, that uh, I have to step away from to do other things with the athletic department and uh, I'm really excited about that though because I, I, I get to spend a lot of time in the summer working with all the sports kids and you know our weightlifting program and um, it's going to be awesome being part of you know saying I'm a part of all those all their successes because they, they've worked really hard boys and girls sports both the coaches there you know in every single sport I've, I love being around them and uh, they're hard workers that make me better as a coach and so I'm excited to work do that whole thing but it's going to be it's going to be busy you know but I'm, I'm it's a good busy you know, the bottom line is, though, in athletics, you got to get in the weight room. The bottom, and it's for every sport these days. Absolutely, you know, and we've got a we've got a program going now year round, and and uh, you know, our motto is one school, one team, and and because we have to share so many athletes anyway, and you know, when when all the guys are at football, you know, two thirds of our basketball team's gone. You know, when all the guys are at baseball, two thirds of this team's gone, and and uh, basketball, and you know, all the sports, we our guys got to keep competing in three or four different things all at once, and and uh, they 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 seem to handle it well. And I think that our coaches work well together to help make that happen. All right, you ready to get this thing going again? I'm ready. I think so. You know, it's it's uh, it's been exciting. We last year ended, and it was one of those things where you never didn't want it to end, but it, but it did, and and uh, it did hurt for a little bit, and uh, then we can get back to the drawing board, put everybody's name back up on the board, and see what we got coming back, and and work toward you know re trying to replace some guys that are irreplaceable every year, you know, and uh, so. I think we're getting there. We had a great team camp, and summer was great in the weight room, and in the uh, winter and spring, and uh, we've gotten stronger, a little bigger, and uh, I think we should be very competitive. You know, I, I know we'll talk about this as the season does roll along, and then not that you forget about those guys from a year ago, but boy, they were such an integral part of your continued success year after year. And like you said, it's going to be hard to replace those guys. Yeah, you really, you can't you can't replace guys like you know like Owen and Jalen and and uh, you know Camden and Blake and you know just any any group any of those seniors last year. Everybody brought something special, and and uh, you know so this year we just kind of look for what's special in the guys we have now, and we try to bring that out in them, and and that's just what you got to do every year you know you, you lose somebody and you spend a whole month thinking how am I going to replace this guy you know and then you got to realize well you're never going to be able to replace a, a kid that can do what that particular kid do at that particular time so we just got to try to find a way to take these other guys and, and give them their moment to do the right thing so I'm excited about it well you got nine pretty good seniors there don't you yeah I do uh really hard working kids great leaders in the school uh you know they're always there to, to get the job done in any situation you need help and uh they're just good men and and I'd rather be surrounded by good men than anything and and I think uh that that's going to carry over to how we play and how we practice and that stuff how's camp gone so far that's going pretty good um you know we got uh, about 56 kids right now which is like you know it's not bad for a 1a school and and uh, a lot of young guys are learning things and uh, the thing I like about this year is there's a lot of competitions for spots and uh, you know, it used to be like this is the guy, you know, easily. And now it's there's competition, a little bit of competition everywhere, and that, that's going to make us stronger, and uh, give us some depth, which is going to be real helpful, especially come tournament time. Um, so it's exciting, it really is. It's uh, the kids are working extremely hard and, and pretty much do anything you ask them to do. So I'm proud of them. And a lot to work on next week before that scrimmage too. Yeah, that's always a tell. Uh, you know, kind of tells the story a little bit for us. Lapel's is really tough, and uh, in, year in and year out, they have great athletes, and it gives us a chance to you know, we. Scrimmage it so it's not exactly what we would do but it gives us a good look at certain situations and how people respond and uh, we learn a lot from it um, in the past we learned a lot from the first game um, and and it wasn't always as a, a point where if you lose it you can't win the conference now but see now we get a new different situation so we got to be prepared a little bit earlier and with Knightstown having a new head coach and a new system they're going to come in with some new excitement and energy and uh, you know uh, their athletes are going to be ready to play they've always they're always tough so it's going to be a situation where we have to be ready to go right off the bat you know can't, can't stumble well before I let you go and I talked to all the seniors about this you guys are the mark guys now I mean everybody's looking out for you because you're the defending champions of the conference yeah yeah and uh you know it's one of those things where you know, it, 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 because we won it last year yeah we're the mark guy but it really matters what we do this year that, that counts so to us it's just kind of we got to get we got to get better every single day and and get really great at the details and and i, I think they got the right mindset toward it hopefully I don't, I don't know how your interviews went so we'll see <laughs> I'll, when i watch those i'll let you know but uh I, for the most part i think they got their head on straight so i'm, I'm excited about how it's going to be for them